Hi everyone, it's Miss Faith and today we're going to be doing some arts and crafts and the craft that I picked for you guys today is finger painting some spring flowers. So what you guys are going to need for this craft is a yellow piece of construction paper, some paints, I just picked red, blue, and white so we're going to mix some colors to make purple and pink and we can even do a lighter blue if I want. Um, we have a nice paper plate with our paints all spread so we can mix some colors. Some Q-tips to mix them if you guys don't want to use your fingers. And some big markers to draw our stems. So I've already drawn my stems on my paper. So I did a uh, hamburger style. And I just drew on my stems. You guys can do them as big or small as you want. Like I did a skinny one. I did a skinny one without any leaves. And then I did a big one with some leaves. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to make my colors. So I'm going to mix red and blue and I'm going to make purple and I might add some white if I don't like how light the color is. So I'm just going to mix the colors until I get the shade of purple I want. Purple color and I'm going to add in some white so that it lightens up the color and I can get the kind of light purple that I want. So I'm gonna mix it until it's like a, like a nice light lavender, kind of like that. But I might add a little bit more white just to get the color that I want. So add in a little bit of white and we'll give it a mix. So I mixed all my colors. So I made pink, I have red, I made a purple, some blue, and I made some light blue and we have white. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pick which stem I wanna use and I'm gonna dip my finger into, I'm choosing purple, but again, you guys can use whatever color you want. And I'm gonna start making little dots to make them look like flowers. So I'll do this for this one. I'm gonna make, I don't know, just like maybe lavender. I'll make a big purple flower. And I'll just dot it until I feel like it's done. And then we'll move on to the next flower. So finish this one up maybe. I might do a little bit more. You can always go back and add if you wanna add a little bit more color or a different color even, or if you wanna make it bigger. But I'm just gonna make it like this. And it's really fun. You guys can just dot it as much as you want. You can put as much or as little paint as you want and make a flower. We finished this flower. I'm going to move on to this one. So for this one, I'm going to do a little bit different. I've already taken some pink paint on my finger and I'm going to draw the petals. So I'm going to make like little half circles and I'm going to do that all the way around the flower. So I'm going to make... Just, you can do as many or as little as you want. I'm gonna do like four. And then, so there's, there's those. And then I'm gonna go around the outside and do a bigger petal on each one. So I'm gonna do like that, like that. Just a little bit like that. So you can make your own kind of flower and then in the middle I'm just gonna dot it a little bit and you can fill it in if you want I'm gonna fill in the middle so you have a big flower and then you can always if you wanted to add some purple or some white I'm gonna add a little bit of white in the middle so I just take in white on my other finger and I'm just gonna add a little bit of white in the middle to show that it's the middle of the flower. So I added a little bit of white. You can smooth out the edges if you want, fill them in. Um, I'm gonna add actually another petal over here. Just a little, just a little flower. So now we have another flower done. And if you want, you can, like I said, you can always go back and add more. If you wanna do a different color, you can add more to that one if you wanted. I might put some white or some blue on it in a minute. And then we're gonna move on to our last flower. Now I'm gonna be right back. I'm gonna wash my hands 
and get all the purple, pink, and white paint off, and then I'll come back and we'll make the last blue flower. I washed my hands, and now we're gonna do the last big flower. And I'm gonna do a flower kind of like the first one, but I'm gonna do it with two different colors of blue. So I'm gonna take my pointer finger and I'm gonna dip it in the dark blue that I didn't mix. And I'm gonna start stamping like I did with the last one. And I'm just gonna stamp, 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 stamp all around until I get the kind of petals that I want. So I'm gonna keep doing this until I have kind of like the same shape as the last one. And then we're gonna go in and we're gonna add some details. So I'm gonna keep stamping. And again, you guys can do whatever kind of flowers you want. I'm just choosing to do these because I think they're pretty and I think they're easy and fun. Um, you know, you guys can paint whatever kind of springtime garden you want. You can do, even if you want to do more than three, if you wanted to do one big flower, it's totally up to you guys. I'm just choosing to do three. And I'm choosing these colors. If you wanted to do yellow or green or orange, if you want to do sunflowers, whatever you guys want, I'm just picking these because I like these kind of flowers. Okay, so now that I have the base of my flowers done, I'm going to take my middle finger right here and I'm going to go into the light blue and I'm going to dot the light blue around this so it gives it a little bit of like realistic, kind of makes it look a little bit more like a real flower that has a bunch of different colors. Now you guys, if you wanted, you could wait for it to dry if you wanted to do a second layer but I'm just doing it while it's wet because to me, it doesn't make that much of a difference. So I'm just gonna do, I'm gonna get a little bit more and add a little bit more around the bottom and up the sides, just so we have a big flower. And on my last finger, I'm gonna take a little bit of white here on my ring finger and I'm just gonna dot some white around like that. And I'm gonna take my middle finger with the light blue, and I'm just gonna stamp in the white so that it blends it in just a little bit. You guys don't have to do this, this is totally optional. I just wanna make it look a little bit more 3D. Okay, so I have my multicolor light blue, dark blue, and white. I have my little pink one with white in the middle and I have my purple one. So that's basically all set. You guys have your little springtime flower garden. If you wanna add a sun in the corner, if you wanna draw some grass, some butterflies, you could always paint a butterfly with your fingers if you wanted. Uh, but yeah, that's, that's pretty much it, guys. All right, guys, I really, really hope you like this video. And this is my finished product. So I just wrote a little Miss Faith's garden on it, but obviously you guys can draw whatever you want. And I really hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you next time. All right. Bye, guys.